Alrighty folks and welcome back to another Rust tutorial. Alright, so in previous videos we set up a automated sorting system, a automated smelting system. Okay, now we're gonna do something that's probably pretty vital and a lot of people will probably use quite a bit. And that's gonna be maintaining your TC. Okay. So Instead of worrying about, you know, oh, well, I need to put this much tea in my TC or keep a bunch of uh, materials in your TC, you can actually set up a little automation in order to maintain your TC so that you don't have to worry about it. All right. All right. So we're going to need a, uh, a storage adapter and we're also going to need a uh, conveyor. All right. So we can just put the conveyor in here be fine. All right. Just like so. All right, and we're going to need to provide a little bit of power. So let's go ahead and find our end, which is right there. All right, so we're going to go from the pass through. All right, go like that. And then to our power input. Okay, so we're going to set a filter on, on, our, on this here. So what are we going to set our filter? And that's going to be for right now. This current base is using stone and uh, metal frags. All right. So, um, just so it'll use a, a little bit of high quality, let's go ahead and uh, we'll just upgrade one of these these doors, these uh, walls here, to a uh, high quality metal. Get a little bit of it here. Obviously, I don't need that much. Okay, so let's go ahead and upgrade the uh, walls here. So you want to upgrade your, let's go make these all uh, all high quality. Here. Why not? All right, we even take off this door here. One like that. Uh, remove the door, and now we're going to put in a let's see, items. We'll put in an armored door instead. All right. All right, so there we go. Now we have our armored door. All right, and let's get away and get a little roof on this. And let's upgrade to high quality. There we go, okay. So now you have your little TC room uh, in some high quality. All right, great. Now let's go ahead and worry about keeping that TC up to uh, as far as what it's going to need. Um, it's found its materials. All right, let's go ahead and take uh, that. We'll just leave that alone for now. All right, so we definitely need some uh, high quality in there. All right, for now, let's just go ahead and put in, oh, like nine. You know, that way says, oh, hey, we, we don't have enough, but it'll be all right then. Okay, so from this, from this conveyor, we're going to go to the output of that, to the input. Come on. Hello. And what does it do? Okay. Oh, pipes being blocked. Okay. That's what the problem is. Okay. So then we're going to have to move our storage adapter here. All right, let's put it on a different location right here in front would be great. Okay. All right, so now we have, now we can go from the output of here to the input here. Okay. And so now we need to provide, uh, we did a little expansion here. So we're now branching on the output one into this another splitter. 
So we're going to take the output two, go down. You can run along the wall if you'd wish. But it does have to go through the uh, through that there, and then we can go up. All right. So now, what's going to end up happening? Oh, we don't want everything. Uh, change your filter, change your filter. Let's turn that off. <laughs> Otherwise, it's going to start filling this thing up with everything. All right, so let's take that out. Uh, we'll take that out. Uh, take out. Take that out, and then... Grab some of that. Okay, obviously we don't need this. Or that. Okay, so let me go ahead and dump these off. Not right now. Okay. Stuff back here again. There we go. All right, so our filter is what we're going to need as far as on here. So, oops, turn that off, change the filter. We're going to add stone. All right, so let's add stone. Uh, we're going to need. Uh, we could you need maybe need a little wood, so we're gonna ahead and put a little wood in here. Alright, uh metal frags. And high quality metal. Okay, so now we need to determine how much we want of each. Okay, so we need at least a little over two thousand. So we're just called we're just gonna round it up to say uh twenty one hundred. So we'll go to this. We'll change our stone to the max of 2100. Okay, so we're just going to put a thousand, thousand wood in there. We don't know we don't need any wood. Okay, and our metal frags, we need 42. Okay, so we're just rounded off to say 50. That'd be fine. Right, so we'll put 50 in there. All right, and in high quality metal, we need 21. We'll say just we need, need just need 25. Okay, so we'll put 25. Now, what I usually like to do is try to get this to at least, you know, oh, at least one day, maybe even uh, three days if you can. Um, not everybody can. Uh, usually, most of it will stack only with 1,000, or these go to, to 100. So you may not have enough space to actually fill for, you know, many days of. Uh, Availability uh, and resources available into your TC. So if you just do it for one day, be it would be just perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay, so with that in mind, we're going to take out some of this. We'll take out a little bit more. All right. So now when we turn this on, okay, it's going to give us exactly what we put in our filter in here. Okay. See if our time's climbing and slowly creep, creeping up. Again, this takes a little bit to, to bring it up, but 
you know, it depends on how many, you know, how much you have in one box. The more it's separated into different chunks, you know, the, the faster this will actually fill up. Instead of just pulling it from one stack, it'll actually pull it, be pulling it from, from many different stacks. All right, there you go. You have exactly one little over one day. Yes, yeah, so like one day, four minutes and 47 seconds. All right, and now you close your door and there you go. Your TC is going to be automatically filled as long as there's resources available to do that. All right, so you, you can always look at your upkeep downtime, your upkeep time, and it'll say, you know, in here, in case it says 24 hours, if you notice anything different, then obviously you ran out of some, some sort of resource. You know, it could be, you know, wood or uh, metal or stone or something like that. It just means you need to go out and get some more. All right, well, that is how you maintain your TC with a little bit of automation. Don't have to mess with it anymore. Makes it nice. Alrighty. Well, I appreciate everybody coming out and joining the, joining the video with me. Until next time, take care of yourselves and each other. Bye-bye for now.